Hi, today our topic is Bajet syndrome. Coming to the diagnostic criteria, recurrent oral ulcers plus two of the following, that is either recurrent genital lesions, eye lesions, skin lesions, and pathology test. Oral ulcers, multiple or single, less than 10 mm size and painful with a central necrotic base, central yellowish necrotic base which stays for one to two weeks and subsides without any scars. Genital lesions are present over the scrotum, spares, glands, penis or urethra and heals with scrotal scars. Skin lesions are present in 80% of patients. In pathology test, the skin lesions may manifest as folliculitis, erythma nodosum, pyoderma gangrenosum. Pathology test, it is a non-specific hyperreactivity of the skin following minor trauma and this is very specific to Bechet's disease. It can be tested with a 20 gauze sterile needle under sterile conditions, it is considered positive if an erythematous sterile papule develops within 48 hours. Eye lesions manifest with scarring and panuveitis, and it is most dreadful complication as it may lead to blindness. It is present in 50% of patients. Joints. It might manifest as non-specific arthralgia or arthritis and present with 50% of patients involves large joints like the knee or ankle. Blood vessels. Peripheral superficial or deep vein thrombosis may manifest in 30% of patients. Arterial thrombosis may be seen in 5% of people. Pulmonary artery vasculitis is also seen. Neurological manifestations are noticed in 5-10% to of patients. Parenchymal involvement may be seen. Interleukin 6 is raised in the CSF and cortical venous thrombosis can also be present. Gastrointestinal manifestations such as mucosal ulcerations of the gut and it is very similar to Crohn's disease. And the other manifestations might be epididymitis, amyloidosis, glomerulonephritis. The lab findings are very non-specific, such as leukocytosis might be present, elevated ESR and CRP. Coming to the treatment for the mucocutaneous lesions, the treatment is tropical steroids and systemic steroids are indicated in oveitis and CNS budgets. Prednisolone 1 mg per kg or azathioprine 2 to 3 mg per kg per day. And cyclosporin 5 mg per kg has been used in site threatening oveitis. Pulse doses of cyclophosphamide are indicated in pulmonary or peripheral artery aneurysm. Thank you.